when you were creating this, I know you had a lot of hatred aimed right at you from diehard, you know, watching fans and stuff. Um, you know, how, how did you get through being told, you can't do this? You know, you're, you, you, can't, you can't change what I grew up with. You know, you can't do that. Um, you know, how do you, how do you deal with uh, being told, no, you can't do that? I think for us, you know, we believe so much in this show that you know, there were sort of two sides to this. There's one, there's the people who sort of, they were, they were angry and they were mean, and, but you could sort of tell that they didn't have that love for the original show. Um, and they sort of were like, they were aware of it somewhat, but they were mostly just angry that, you know, we changed it at all, whether or not that they had that past with it. But then there were the people who did have a past. And I noticed something when I was kind of looking at those people, even when they were angry and when they were scared of what we were going to do, I could tell that they still cared a lot and that a lot of them seemed like they wanted to give it a chance. And so that was something that it was like, you know, those were the people that I, you know, listened to. Because when someone's just like yelling, you know, angry, mean things at you, you don't really have to listen to that, you can just walk away. But then when it's someone who's like, I'm like, I do want this person to give the show a shot, I do hope they find something in it that they love, um, something that feels true to the show that they grew up loving. And so, and I, it was really, really wonderful to see, because we believed in the show so much that we, we knew if they just gave it a chance, that we, they wouldn't find something in it that they loved. By the magic of the sunstone, you're tuned into the Jewel Riders Archive.